try to beat the rain, welcome everybody. It's, uh, I'm Phil Ginsburg, the general manager of San Francisco's Recreation and Park Department. And I want to thank everybody for joining us today for the official rollout of park-wide bike rentals. Parkwide is going to be at five park sites throughout the city, and this is really hopefully the launch of what will eventually blossom into a park by park and maybe someday even street corner to street corner uh, network of bike sharing and bike rentals. Parkwide is a very is a new park amenity that's going to allow visitors the opportunity to rent a bike at one city park and actually ride to another and drop it off. Uh, we're we're thrilled. I mean, imagine. Uh, uh, somebody renting a bike in Union Square and uh, taking a ride into beautiful Golden Gate Park uh, and coming to see the incredible Academy of Sciences in front of us uh, and then, uh, you know, taking the bus home. It all works perfectly. We're thrilled. And uh, this is a partnership that is really a win-win all the way around. Uh, Parkwide not only is going to make it easier for residents and visitors to get out and bike and to see this city's incredible park system, but it's an agreement that is going to activate our public spaces and help keep our parks clean, safe, and fun. Uh, we expect park-wide bike rentals to bring in uh, more than a million dollars in revenue to support department operations over the next five years. So I want to thank uh, all of the folks who've supported this effort and worked to make it possible. Uh, I want to thank Mayor Lee, who I'm going to bring up to say a few words in a second. I want to thank the Board of Supervisors for their support uh, of this concession, particularly our District 1 Supervisor here in Golden Gate Park, Eric Marr. I want to thank the Recreation and Park Commission, President Mark Buell, and with us today is Commissioner David Lee. I want to thank uh, Leah Sham and all of the supporters in the San Francisco Bike Coalition for their incredibly passionate advocacy and support of uh, biking and biking in parks and healthy recreational activities. And I really want to thank uh, Parkwide. Uh, Jeannie and Luisa Orlana uh, is, are here, Daryl White and Jeff Sears, thank you for your patience and, and your vision and your uh, uh, doggedness because that's what's needed to bring a good idea to San Francisco. Um, and last but not least, I really want to thank uh, my staff, San Francisco Recreation and Parks Partnership and Resource Development Team, which has been doing just a tremendous job over the last couple of years thinking about creative new strategies as our general fund dollars get you know, tighter and tighter, and parks need more investment than ever. Um, our partnership and resource development team has really worked creatively uh, and um, uh, incredibly effectively at um, adding park amenities that park users enjoy that also help us sustain this incredible park system of ours. So I want to thank uh, Nicole Averill and Nick, Nick Kinsey and Cassandra Costello who are over there. Thank you, guys. And of course, all of this falls in line with the city's goal of making our communities in places like Golden Gate Park and the Academy of Sciences more bike friendly and easier to visit for parents and families and uh, even uh, alligators. And I think our alligator was scared of the rain, but we were supposed to have one today. But I will uh, actually do a plug. Uh, Helen Taylor from the Academy is here. And uh, if you happen to rent a bike from Parkwide and you're a little lost and don't know how to get through Golden Gate Park, all you need to do is take out your iPhone and uh, download uh, the Academy of Sciences Golden Gate Park Field Guide app, and which has, uh, in, in addition to all kinds of incredible environmental information about this park and about the Academy, has two bike routes. So we've thought this thing through well. Thank you, the Academy of Sciences, and thank you, Helen. So um, I now want to bring up our mayor, who uh, in the last year has certainly demonstrated himself to be a champion of our parks uh, and of biking, healthy recreational options, and um, uh, environmentally friendly transportation. Where are you, Mr. Mayor? Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Good morning, everyone. Well, I, I also wanted to express my thanks to the collaboration that's occurred today with Bicycle Coalition, with Rec and Park Commission, with the Park Wide, and with all the other park locations that we have. Now, this is just the beginning. You have uh, today, I think, the first semblance of what we have talked about for some time now, that's bike sharing in the city. There's something that's going to be start, uh, starting uh, early next year, led by the SFMTA, and uh, when these parks start happening for our recreational users, we're going to also uh, meet with more commuters and to make sure that they can have a chance to use bikes as they go to work or do all the other daily things. As you know, the 
bicycle uh, growth in this city has been phenomenal over the past few years. And so we want to do that much more accommodation. I think it's a really neat idea for us to be able to begin in one park. And today, uh, you can go from here to the marina, if you wish, or Justin Herman Plaza. Marina will begin in November, but Justin Herman Plaza, you can go today and drop off that bike. And on your way, you can pass by City Hall and vote <laughs> for the next few weeks as well. And just do some important activities while you're also playing around too. So uh, this, is, this is an amazing part. I, I really do like the idea that you can just drop it off and not worry about it. Uh, you can go by the hour, you can go by the day. Uh, everything is taken care of. And I think that's just a solid beginning of bike sharing that we'll see all across this whole city, as well as across the Bay Area. I think this is uh, yet another indication too that we want to be uh, alternative mode transportation uh, friendly. And so we're working with the other cities around the Bay Area to do the same thing so that for those enthusiasts who want to go from city to city, they'll be able to do that as well. And I think that's going to be an exciting part of this. So I did, again, I want to really thank all the agencies for coming together and promoting this. This is a great kickoff, but this is just the beginning. I look forward to even more folks using this and getting not only the exercise and the fresh air, but uh, being able to get out of their cars and, and uh, with their families and with their friends and exercise this wonderful option to leave the bikes wherever uh, there are stations in the various parks and just go about doing both your business and pleasure. Thank you very much. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. I now want to bring up our District 1 supervisor uh, who presides over Golden Gate Park. And uh, th one, one thing about Eric is um, Eric really is a true user of this park and all of its amenities. There is not a weekend uh, that goes by, it seems, Eric, when we don't bump into each other doing something in Golden Gate Park. Um, so thank you for being such a champion of our park system and of Golden Gate Park. Thank you. Thank you, everyone, for being here. Um, it is like my backyard or front yard because I live across the street on 7th Avenue in Fulton. But I brought my bike today, I brought my Levi's <laughs> jeans so that we can all ride together. And I wanted to thank um, Parkwide for kind of their vision and the mayor, and especially the Recreation and Parks Department. Um, not only Phil, but also Cassandra, Nick, and Nicole, and others in the Recreation and Parks Department um, for their vision of improving biking so that more families and everyone in the city can take advantage of this. I also like the $1 million a year, hopefully, and more that this will bring in for our Recreation and Parks Department. Um, the Richmond District is just one neighborhood, and I know more bikers kind of around here will come to the Richmond, but also the Sunset side and also the um, other sides of the park as well. Um, I wanted to say that the Bicycle Coalition has been tremendous in promoting um, better bikeways from the Embarcadero all the way to Ocean Beach, and I strongly support efforts. But I think efforts like this will help us kind of make sure that San Francisco is number one as a biking city in this country. So thank you for being here with us. I can't wait to ride. Thanks a lot, Bill. Thank you, Eric. Um, our next speaker is uh, Commissioner David Lee, and the Rec and Park Commission has been uh, uh, a big champion of our efforts to create more family-friendly amenities in our parks. So to say a few words, Commissioner Lee. I just want to say uh, what a tremendous uh, asset that Phil Ginsburg has been for this department. Uh, Phil has the best ideas, and he comes up with them often. And I know he's all, always thinking about ways to uh, raise money for this department. And we are really grateful for Phil's leadership in this department and uh, looking forward to new and more ideas from Phil in the coming years. Uh, I chair the Capital Committee at the Recreation Park Commission and we uh, do a lot of the fix-ups in the, in the city. So we fix our playgrounds, we fix our, our uh, recreation facilities, and we're administering the uh, bond that the 2008 bond that is going into uh, uh, fixing up um, recreation centers all across town. And I, I had an idea just talking to Leah um, uh, from the San Francisco Bicycle Coalition uh, as we were out here um, thinking maybe one of the things that we could be doing is installing more bicycle racks. Uh, the reason being is as people are renting bicycles, people from the neighborhood come to our facilities, they can have a place to lock up their bicycle uh, and enjoy it, and if you enjoy the facility. And if you look at all the fabulous parks in our uh, city and in our, in our neighborhood, and even right here in the concourse, uh, it would be a great advantage for people to be able to lock up their bicycle, perhaps have a picnic, 
get back on the bike and go on to another location. And so that's something I hope to explore and to work with the Bicycle Coalition to see uh, how and where we can put these uh, bicycle racks. Uh, with that, uh, thank you all for coming. Thank you, David. So um, the Recreation and Park Department has a great partnership with the San Francisco Bicycle Coalition. In addition to their support of um, Parkwide, and uh, we've, we're working together uh, to create a dedicated bike lane uh, in Golden Gate Park. Uh, we've worked together on uh, Sunday streets and Sunday street closures and also healthy Saturdays. And yes, we want more bike, ra uh, more bike racks. So to talk a little bit more about our partnership, uh, Leah Sham. Thank you so much, Phil, for your leadership to the Recreation and Park staff, who I know have been working so hard on this, and to the commissioners. Thank you so much to Mayor Lee and Supervisor Marr. In my, gosh, almost 15 years of working on bicycle advocacy in this city, I haven't seen this kind of political commitment and this kind of community support. We're seeing it because San Franciscans love bicycling. This is one more great sign that our parks want to draw people to the city by bicycle, that the California Academy of Sciences wants its visitors to come by bike, that restaurants and cafes, the neighborhoods really see the value in drawing more people, whether they're locals like me or the growing number of tourists riding by bike, to come out to the neighborhoods and enjoy our city by bike. I think we will be number one in the nation soon on that. We're on our way. Today's launch of Parkwide is a real sign of that. It's one more commitment from the city. But it's really, it's a commitment that's responding to a demand. We know more and more people want great biking conditions. As Mayor Lee mentioned, it's been nearly a 60% increase of people biking in the last 40 years, and that is growing. And I'd love to see the day when you see the front of the Academy of Sciences just filled, racks in the front filled with tiny bikes, so that kids coming from schools, from uh, throughout the neighborhoods are not only coming to this great institution to learn about the importance of sustainability and about the importance of our, our intricate fabric of our planet, but actually riding the ride, walking the walk as well. Kids are seeing how they can integrate sustainability, environmental awareness into their own life by visiting this institution and this beautiful park and parks throughout the city by bicycle. So I think today is a huge opportunity, not only for, for great bike use today, but to really be educating generations to come. I also really want to thank the Parks Department and Commission um, looking ahead to hopefully their support of a new bikeway on JFK Drive. Uh, Mr. Ginsburg mentioned that. We're really excited about welcoming more people to Golden Gate Park with a safe, dedicated, inviting bikeway that's family friendly, that really is connecting our city, every single neighborhood, bringing folks here on safe, inviting bikeways that are really safe for 8 to 80. So thank you, looking ahead for that, and we look forward to riding. Thank you, Leah. And last but certainly not least, the folks who we're celebrating today, again, for your uh, vision and partnership, and uh, did I mention patience? Uh, our friends from Parkwide. So come on up and say a few words. Jeannie, are you going to come up and speak? Thank you. Hi, everyone. Thank you for coming. Um, I just want to introduce all the members of Parkwide, Daryl White, Jeff and Elena Sears, and my husband, Luis Sorolana. Um, we all own our own bike rental companies and formally and still compete in those companies, but we came together to form Parkwide to address this giant network of bike rental need in our city. So we're opening all these bike rentals in parks, and we hope you join us and come out and bike the parks. And I'd like to give everyone that has supported us a hat for that effort. Thank you. That's good because it's raining. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Not to be used as a bike helmet. Thank you all. <laughs> Thank you. And and uh, Jeannie didn't say this, but but Parkwide, the the consortium of, of bike rental companies that makes up Parkwide, has over 50 years of uh, bike rental experience in the city. And so we're very pleased. Thank you guys for being our partner. And uh, let's uh, get out and ride. Thank you very much. <laughs> all right, now we go this way. <laughs> now we got it. It's just like a. Oh, oh, all right. Truth be told, my steering wheel doesn't do anything. <laughs> <laughs> this is just a prop.
Thank you.